guys, today I want to talk about vinyl background, but how care about vinyl background use again and have for a long time. Hey guys, if you don't know me, I am Monika from Photo in Shadow. I am food and product photographer like you see here. I teach the same here on my channel, how to work with natural light, artificial lights, how to photograph a product, how to photograph food and many things. But now I want to show you how I care about this background for what I can use for a long time. Let's go. I photography today the drinks and I use new background what I bought uh, few weeks ago from the company Fixed Backdrop have a lot of different vinyl background I have few I ordered only four one looks that one looks that and another what you have here with the setup for this uh, video is the vinyl background this company have the same uh, handmade background but I ordered vinyl and handmade background I ordered the same but today I want to talk about vinyl background when I order this background uh, when coming I have instruction how to care about this background what I can use for a long time that's I think maybe I do this time the video about vinyl background how to care about vinyl background because I cannot find too much information uh, online that's I think maybe I do the video about this and uh, and really show you like how you can care and use long time this uh, background when i working with vinyl background i use many times vinyl background now especially in food photography product photography this is like the best type of uh, background what i use and i like to use and this background believe me i won't use for long because the material is not so strong this is like a good material but not that strong like wood what you can have um, uh, more um, more strong is uh, not so strong that you shouldn't put here like a hot uh, pot or something hot uh, on straight away on this background you should have like some desk or something different things what you can put on uh, first and later the hot pot because will be uh, damage the background will be do the mark or sometimes can do the hole and completely damage the background. Sometimes when I photography drinks, I think about like when I splash something, we do like that and splash the water. Straight away, clean this. Don't leave this for a long time, clean. But what I use? I use only wipe and normal water, maybe with soap, but not with strong detergent. And a strong detergent because will be damaged the background uh, sometimes can change the color of the background or something enough is good uh, have the uh, the cloths and only water and that's it when you're using like strong maybe something product like say juice with beetroot or carrots or turmeric uh, the same straight away clean this uh, on your background don't left for too long because can be damaged uh, the background Another thing is when you use the vinyl background, when I finish the photo shoot, I never leave uh, background uh, dirty. Straight away I clean because I know if I leave this background for a long time, don't clean, will be damaged the background. Uh, later I, I cannot clean this so good. What you can do for straight away, you finish your shoot and clean the background. And believe me, this, uh, uh, this is easy things. And I do that always when I finish my uh, shoot. When I photograph food and then you splash some oil or something ingredients, straight away clean. The same, only water and uh, cloths, nothing more. Uh, your background will be clean and you can use for, uh, for a long time. Believe me, this is only few things what you should uh, do when you wanted to use long time the vinyl background. Don't put the same the background in a strong uh, light like if you photograph in natural lights don't leave uh, the background in in on the sun because will be take the color if you have like color backgrounds for uh, this can damage how strong is your color and will be not that strong this is only few things what you should always to do uh, to care about your background like clean straight away don't put a hot pot straight away on your background when you're using something food what uh, is strong color like carrots beetroot or turmeric straight away clean 
you clean this only water you don't use any strong detergent or uh, some strong uh, product because will these things will be damage your background but that is only few things what you should use and you can use really long this uh, background one thing what I can say uh, about this background, Wiener background is one, one of my favorite background. This is a background company Pix Backdrop. The company is in Poland, make a lot of different uh, texture the background. Background is 60 to 90. You can order online everything. Below, I left the link below about company where you can order and more details about company if you are interesting. I recommendation to buy vinyl background. First, you can roll, take with you everywhere. It's not, uh, don't take too much space. You can have different color, different pattern there. Another things for vinyl background is easy to use, easy to keep it in your studio. Don't take too much uh, space. It's not so expensive and you buy one times and you can use for a long time if you really care about your background, what I say before. This, help you to understand how to work with vinyl background, what you can use long time, how to care about this vinyl background. Thank you for watching this uh, video. Don't forget to subscribe, leave the button uh, like and leave the comment. And thank you for today and see you soon.